Welcome back, this is Yamajack. Today we got Gunslinger Corridor Endless Suicidal. That's right, we're playing Endless. Let's go ahead and enable cheat so that we can do that and we don't have to walk all the way back down here, although we'll probably end up doing that anyway. Just because uh, in the later waves and especially the uh, boss waves, we're gonna have to. We're gonna get pushed back a fair bit. We'll, uh, we'll, we'll call it like that, okay? These mobs are, uh, are these Zeds, they are a little bit tricky to handle when you've got, you know, hundreds of them. Thousands of them. Now, I don't know how long we'll go for. I'm, uh, I'm not the greatest KF2 player around, so I, I, I certainly can't say that we'll just go, oh, right, run endless anyway. Oh, the Rhino. Um... I certainly can't say that I'm the best, so I, uh, I we will not be able to just go until I get bored of it. We will die eventually. I'm just I'm not sure uh, what's what's my limit at. Probably a half an hour. So I have to uh, at 8:04 I have to go check on my Terraria stuff to, to check that out. So half an hour is a pretty good video if we make it there. I'm hoping we do. There's no guarantee we might die before that. I'm I'm known to die in KF2 on occasion. I did just die in the last video, in fact. Can happen. You know, I'm not perfect. I'm not infallible. I'm highly fallible, in fact. I'm, I'm about as fallible as it comes, you know? Just, just fallibling up all over the place here. I was, uh, earlier today in my group of friends, we have, uh, it'll be even funnier if I'm forgetting somebody, so I, I hope I am, but I also kind of hope I'm not. Uh, but in our inner little, you know, Discord server that we got, we have, uh, four trans women, including myself. Um, and earlier, somebody was mentioning three of us, no way, oh my god. There's uh, there's five of us. I did forget somebody, and it's the same person I forgot earlier too. Uh, but I'll get to that. Um, somebody was mentioning the three of us, uh, or three of us, rather not the three of us, and been like, you know, so and so, so and so, and Charlotte. It's the trans trifecta, the transfecta. I'm like, oh well, you're you're forgetting, you know, this person. How rude. Like who the heck's that? <laughs> they'd uh, they'd they'd completely forgot about it. So I I poked some fun at uh, at them for that, and I I did it poorly. I I didn't pull the joke off, so I I, I mostly looked like I was just actually saying that they're rude. Um. So then they ended up kind of feeling bad. And then somebody else comes in and is like, "Yeah, there's also you know this person." So I'm like, "Yeah, I also forgot somebody." I don't know. I found it kind of funny how I'm uh, poking fun at somebody for forgetting. One of the five trans people in the server. And then I'm also, you know, at the same time forgetting one of the five trans people in the server. I mean, in my defense, the one person who I forgot is is highly inactive, and in their defense, the person they forgot is also highly inactive and new. It's like it's a combination that's not good for memory. I'm out as much as I can be, Hans. I can't be out anymore. I left the closet years ago, buddy. You what? You just like did a 180 like that and then just came back immediately. He normally runs away a little bit more than that. He normally runs away a little. You what? Really? I mean, I know that they have reduced health when on on wave five. Um, I'm, I'm pretty sure he has like half health right now. Uh, so so we, we we're really able to just kind of destroy him. He's, it's, it's, it gives you a false sense of confidence when when you fight the uh, the wave five boss on endless because you're like, man, this I can I can do this. And then the wave ten boss comes around and it's like an actual boss <laughs> with actual health. And actual damage. 
I haven't had a phone go off in a video in a long time. I'm pretty good for it. I've been pretty good for it. I've been keeping my phone on quiet while I record. But uh, there you there you go. I think we've had some buzzing. I think I've had some buzzing, but I haven't had a full blown, you know, bup bada bup bup in a little while. I wonder when the last time I did that was. I don't know. I'm thinking I am gonna start recording some Terraria videos for the for the new channel. Maybe it's a big it's a big maybe because I want to make a uh, I want to make a mage playthrough and I'm thinking I might record and again I uh, I've talked about uh, how I, I I don't play it with just the one world like I I'd, I'd, I'd be playing on the same world just going through the progression of uh do I want to upgrade this? <laughs> yeah. I was going through progression of a mage instead. Um. But. I actually forgot that they have custom stuff in the waves. I like complete, it just completely shut me. Anyway, I, uh, I, I continue to. Rhino's really not good for for Tiny Terror either, because you have so many of these just like bouncing around and it just, you end up really shrinking some of these guys down. And, and, ah, uh, it's, it's, this is, this is my like arch nemesis right here. Anyway, I, uh, I, I'd still be playing on the same world, I just, I just make a new world to, to like progress in and build a little thing and then I, I wouldn't like build another fishery, I wouldn't build another like herb farm, I wouldn't build another like pirate farm I just I wouldn't use the items that I have but I'd use the, the like you know stuff that I've built um, I might make like a, a little shack or something in the world for the new character but in my opinion it would be a good way to show off the main worlds I wouldn't have to worry about uh, making stuff too much you know if I want to make like a a new farm is going to take a whole bunch of time. I just make it. I don't have to do it on video because, like, half the stuff in the vid the series isn't even on video anyway. And I don't know. Maybe like do time lapses of it or something. But that's that's already getting into too much for me. So I don't know. I think I am going to do it though. I'm definitely going to have some guides for uh, for building farms and stuff because I'm I'm really good at that, and I think it'd be fun to make some guides for it. I just I don't know if I'm gonna have any like progression videos. I think I think I am. I, I'm thinking I will. Now that's but uh, for for me, master mode is just a little bit. I know I was talking recently about how it's like too easy, but I I do think that it I think that Terraria as a whole is is too hard of a game for me to to want to make like a progression thing on. And then I also just don't. Feel like Moon Lord is the end of it, and I don't want to commit to like a long series. But perhaps we will have a um a series. If we do, it'll be like a mage or or uh, melee or something. Summoner maybe. I'd like to play Summoner too. I might I might do some kind of some kinds of playthroughs like that. I just. Uh, well, once an episode actually takes, like, I don't know, more time working for the episode. Like, if I, like, if I, if I separate the, the stuff from, from the world that I actually play on, and then, um, the YouTube series, and I have to make a decision, you know, what, am I going to be working on my own personal thing, or am I going to be working on the YouTube series? And that's when, for me, it gets into, like, a... I don't like this territory so much, you know, because that's that's when all of a sudden I'm in, in I'm investing time into the the series and I'm starting to, to add a whole bunch of extra stuff. Whereas if I don't have to make that decision, then my own personal time is spent, you know, making potions and getting supplies for PVM and building supplies and all this kind of stuff. So when I start up an episode, I already have all that ready and I didn't have to like do that. You know what I mean? Because I've already did it. There's no like I don't know. 
It's, it's I, I'm not, I'm not doing a good job of explaining it. I don't think, but um, oh, yeah. especially for the epis for for making a series. Why did I walk all the way back? Especially for making a series out of it, it just, it makes it a lot more tempting for me personally if uh, if I play it the way that I play it, which is good because that's the way I play it. <laughs> Sometimes I wonder how people even understand what I'm talking about. But uh, if I if I do that would that would be it, and then and then uh, some some guides on making farms and stuff like that. I don't want to make like a, a video on it though, you know. I just I don't want to. So I don't know. You may you might see some. It'll be on the new channel, of course. Uh, KF2 is the only content that will go on this channel. I thought that was his head, and so when he stood up, I was like, what the heck is going on? He's just standing up on his head. He's doing a headstand, man. It it, it really. It really, it really confused me. I'll, I'll put it that way. I was highly confused. Uh, yes, of course you want tier 5 deagles. Tier 5 deagles are like... Bay. So we'll work towards those. Um, we could pick up a Glock. Yeah, we could. We will. We will. Next next wave or the wave after? Um, yeah, this, this channel is the only one that will get... Uh, this channel will only get KF2 content. Nothing else ever. The new channel's coming soon. I am definitely setting up the uh, the Minecraft server tonight. That's like what I'm gonna do after I record this. Really, just get that set up. Um, Cause it's like do <laughs> for sure. I'm the one that has to do it for like a, a group of people who are just kind of waiting for me to do it. Nobody's been harassing me about it, so I'm kind of like. I don't know, but uh, it's it's definitely about time for me to to get off my butt and do that. I don't know. I've just I've been hyper fixated on Terraria lately, and it's been hard for me to think about anything else. Um, but uh, so that's that's gonna be going up today. Uh, I don't know when we'll record the first episode, if we're going to be doing like a collaboration thing for the first episode or whatever, I don't know. Uh, but, don't have the money M5 off, are you kidding me? But, whenever whenever that does happen, and I we end up having... Seven? Scrakes? Yeah. Um, and we end up having the, the server going, and then we make the first episode if we have a collaboration or whatever. Then, you know, I have to start uploading. It's as simple as that. It's kinda, it kind of forces my hand, so I will be setting up the server tonight. I'll be getting started on it. I don't know if I'll be able to actually get it running tonight, necessarily. Uh, but I'm going to get it started. I'm going to buy the server for sure tonight. I've, I've just been putting it off. And I, I really, like, this is, it's, it's getting a little bit too late for... For me personally, I think it's, it's just, it's, uh, yeah, it was supposed to be a while ago. I feel really bad about it, but it's okay. It'll, it'll get done, and then, you know, it's done, right? It'll be done, and then it's done. That's that, that's all there is to it, so. But, yeah, there's, there's some... Anyway, so there will be new content over there. We'll have Gunslinger Reborn. Uh, Yamajack tries. Um, I'd probably rather have the Glock upgraded than this, I think. Uh, the Yamajack tries, of course. Uh, we will have the Minecraft RuneScape. And, uh, possibly Terraria stuff. Well, definitely some Terraria stuff. I just don't know if you have progression. It's for me, I, I, I don't know. There, there's just a certain... I don't like recording games I'm bad at. I don't mind streaming them, but Terraria is not really a good stream game in my opinion either. At least not the way that I play it. Um, so if I'm not like winning and I'm dying a whole bunch, it just, it just feels bad to put all that... Like have a video of me dying a whole bunch of times to the Moon Lord? Like I don't know. It just doesn't feel good to me. It just doesn't feel good. Of course not. But if I do do a Terraria series, it won't be 
like a scheduled thing. It'll just be whenever I have a video, it goes up. Because I'm going to just play the game and then record it and edit it when I want to kind of thing. Um, but I don't know. It, it'll, it'll come eventually. But there will be new content on the, the other channel. So if you want other kind of content, go subscribe there. Because it'll be, it'll be very, 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 very soon. Again, I am, I am going to be getting the... Uh, The, um... My god, that's a lot of quarter pounds. The, the server live today, hopefully. And then whenever we decide to, to actually start playing on it, we will, uh, we will do that, and then I have to get the episodes up. And then, you know, at that point, it's just like, well, I have to start uploading everything for the channel, because, you know, I gotta just do that. So. It's very, 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 very soon. I'd, I'd expect it in the next couple of days, honestly. Um, so, I've been talking about it for a while, but it's, it's here now, and it's, it's kind of, it's got to happen, so. Jeez, what are you doing, buddy? Yeah, I'd probably rather have the Glock upgraded than the Rhino. I'd probably rather have the M1911, too, to be honest. I like the M1911. We don't use it anymore ever since the Glock came out. Used, uh, the old build used to be the uh, Dual Deagles AF or the uh, 500 and the uh, single M1911. And then the Glock came out and it was just like, yeah, no, if you're playing Gunslinger, really what you do is Tier 5 Deagles plus uh, plus Tier 5 Glock. It's, it's, that's really your, your bread and butter right there. <laughs> tier 5 Deagles is the bread. And uh, the Glock is the... Okay, can you launch me up higher, please? Okay, we'll just, uh... We'll just, we'll just kill you then. That's okay, too. <laughs> you know Gunslinger's kind of broken. When the Flesh Pound, the King Flesh Pound, pins you in a corner. And you still end up barely taking any damage in the fight. There, there's just it. It says something about the state of the game. If, if we were commando, we probably would have died. If we were demo, we would have probably lived because we'd have the kaboom stick and can you know kaboom our way out of that. It was like I, there was a moment in my in my as I was struggling in that uh, in that you know into the wall kind of situation there that we were just in. There was a moment in my brain where I was like, you know, I can't get out, but I can probably kill him. And uh, I committed and it worked. I had no doubts the entire time. I didn't think we were gonna die. I just didn't want to be pinned. I wanted to, I wanted to walk backwards, you know? I wanted to kite him down a little bit more. Ultimately, it's just a King Flash Pound. What's he gonna do? Kill you? Ha! <laughs> Dude doesn't have enough DPS. I do have enough DPS. That's the difference here, okay? Stupid King Flash Pound trying to. What's what's the word called? When when like uh, it's like it's like a Japanese word, and they like, you know, you got a girl, and then you got the guy, and he's like, you know. Slamming his hand on the wall. This is a really terrible spot to, to fight a whole bunch of husks in, by the way. I don't know if you noticed, but we're like kind of just in a really bad situation for exactly this that, that's happening right now. Because really, it's just it's just a straight shot for for the damn husks, you know. You are your problem, okay? I really didn't think we'd live. I thought that would be the end of us. <laughs> I do not like the husk waves. I don't like the husk waves on any map, let alone the uh, corridor. My god. Too many husks. I was not... I, I know I, I know that looked very impressive. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe it didn't. But I know that it looked like I was uh, 
nailing those shots on the, the husks. Explosive bits. At least at the start, anyway. I That was 100% just spray and pray. I don't know. Maybe, maybe you know, maybe, maybe there's more to spray and pray than, than I'm giving it credit for, you know? Maybe there's, uh, maybe there's spray and pray, and then there's kind of, like, spray in the general direction of where you want the bullets to land. Maybe that takes, you know, at least a smidgen of skill. <laughs> I definitely, uh, <laughs> it was, it was definitely just mashing the button and hoping stuff hit, though. Which is a lot of what happens right now with the stupid shrinking zeds. like Tiny Terror, man. Tiny Terror is garbage. It's like... I don't know. There, there's a mod that uh, that removes it. This uh, it moves Tiny Terror, moves Edars, I believe, from the Husks and the uh, Stalker waves, because apparently they, they... Well, no, not apparently. You saw it. It was a Husk wave, and, and Edars were showing up, which is like, bruh. Uh, and then I believe they also show up on stalker waves, which you might see here. Nope. This is a terrible wave, by the way, for berserkers <laughs> in particular. It's a great wave for sharpshooters because you just get the whole see the whole bunch of explosions. Terrible wave for for like closed in battles as well and a terrible way to get a whole bunch of these stupid edars on like edars and quarter pounds just is there a worse combination edars quarter pounds and boom like what 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 worse combination can you come up with crawlers and boom maybe I have to shoot you. What happens a lot when you play uh, multiplayer boom, or multiplayer endless, is um, people will see you surrounded by Zeds and then kill them to try and like help you, and then you die to all the explosions. Oh, it's so funny. It's so funny, because you know that they're like, you know, trying to help. They're just not helping. And uh, especially if you're in voice and you can like hear them be like, oh crap, I totally forgot, I'm so sorry. And it's just like, it's okay. It's okay, mistakes happen, but at the same time, if you ever do that again, I, I will murder you and your parents and your kids and your entire family line. You have to stay silent after a uh, a statement like that to really drive home that like you're not kidding. This isn't a joke. There's, this is no laughing matter. This isn't a bit. There's no punchline. It's just I, I'm gonna kill you. You, know, you have to you have to give it that silence. You have to give it that silence. Then you have to come back with a punchline, or else people will actually think that you're gonna kill them, and you don't want that. You gotta make sure they don't think that you're gonna kill them. Them thinking that you're gonna kill them makes it a lot harder for you to actually go through with the act of killing them. So you have to make sure that you throw in a punchline afterwards, get people laughing a little bit, and like, uh, are you actually gonna kill me, or are you just kind of like joking? And then they uh, they stay up for like a couple of nights, and they're like, well, I guess you're not gonna kill me. And then they get relaxed, and that's when you come in and you kill them. I don't speak from experience, I speak from uh, anecdotal history. Isn't murder a fun topic? Why do, why do so many jokes revolve around murder? It's just that shock humor part, right? Like, you know, that escalation of, like, wow, you went from that to just, like, I'm gonna kill you now, huh? Really, you just, you just, you went there, huh? And then I guess that, uh, that contrast is funny. It's humorous. 
to see the overreaction to to something mundane. Which is not at all what I am saying shooting Zeds next to me in an endless boom wave is. That's certainly not mundane, that is antagonistic and evil. Probably. I mean there's a good quote for it, right? Never uh what is it? Never equipped to uh malice what can adequately be explained by ignorance is that it never attribute to mal never attribute to malice what can be adequately explained by ignorance or something like that you know never say somebody's trying to get you chances are they're just too dumb to realize they did Now, you know, sometimes that doesn't necessarily work, but this is a great situation uh, for that. It's definitely, you know, typically when somebody shoots you in, a, in an endless boom wave. As aggravating as it is, they weren't really out to get you. They weren't, they weren't trying to, you know, generally speaking, they weren't, they weren't trying to, to kill you. They were, they were probably trying to help you and just, you know, it slipped their mind, but, you know, that's going to kill you. Oh, but it happens all the time. Such a such a common occurrence. Not that it will matter. You'll still die. It's it's so funny. It's so funny. Walk it off. And it's really funny when you're playing with friends. And then they don't know what boom does, really. And they get an idea, because it says boom and then stuff starts exploding. Uh, but they're not like prepared to you know deal with it, right? Like until you've actually got the experience playing the game and, and you have you know all that that you need to, to know what you're doing and, and have that confidence um, you're still jeez chances are good that you're still gonna be putting yourself in a dangerous situation just out of habit because you don't you don't have that uh, you have the habit built up to, to not do that when it's tiny terror right or when it's a uh, boom so they're still gonna be surrounded by Zets and then you can kill them and it's funny they hate you for it but it's, it's kind of like the blue shell in Mario Kart right sometimes your friends hating you is funny. Okay? It's just, you know, it, sometimes it goes a little bit too far when you get 18 blue shells in a row and now we're not friends anymore and I'm going to kill you and your parents and your children and your whole family line. You know, at a certain point, it just, it, 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 it's no longer, it's no longer funny. And then at a certain point, it becomes funny again, though. You know, there's no denying that. I mean, there's always a, a part where, where something becomes unfunny because you've just done it so much that, like, yeah, I get it. Like, you're doing this, really? Like, I've seen it. Thanks. And then at a certain point, it becomes funny again because you're like... You know, I guess it transitions from laughing at a joke or laughing at... Uh, um, Laughing at a joke or, or laughing at at you know whatever it is that they're doing that was initially funny and is no longer funny, and it just transitions to laughing at their pathetic excuse of humor. And uh, you know they're they're okay with that. That's the goal. You know a lot of a lot of my humor, a lot of my jokes are uh, created. They're designed with the mind with the thought in mind of uh, you know I don't. Uh, Oftentimes when I tell a joke to, to friends or whoever, you know, I'm not looking for somebody to be like, that's a really funny joke, you had a good punchline, and there was a good startup, and you know, blah, 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 blah. No, I'm just, I'm looking for them to, to kind of like sit there and be like, you idiot, that's not how, no! <laughs> you know, like that kind of a reaction where they're just like laughing at you. It's still funny, and uh, if you're okay with being the, the village idiot, then you know, hey, it works out, right? So I think I am going to have to end the, uh, we'll, we'll kill this boss and then I guess that's it because I have to go and check on my Terraria stuff and I also don't want to commit to like, I don't know. At this point I kind of feel like I could just keep going, <laughs> so. I don't really want to commit to like an hour long video. I gotta end it somewhere. Wave 25 is a good, uh, ending point I think. The bosses don't get harder now, like the last King Flesh Pound we fought is the same difficulty as this one, so. We didn't die to that one. Probably not going to die to this one either. 
Buff boss could kill us. Uh, Patriarch could kill us probably. I don't think he would, but uh, he could. Really, you're just gonna keep firing your. Really, you're just gonna like I I I'd, I'd do something else if I were you personally, but you know you do you. I'd uh, I'd have done something else, but so be it. Oh, it's a big money spray. That's a big money spray. We should do endless more often because I like this money spray. Anyway, um, I guess that's gonna do it for today. It's weird. I, I don't know how to end the episode on an endless when you don't die. I guess I just kill myself. Wait, I have a button for this. I have a button for it. I don't remember. I don't remember what my button is, but I have a button for it. I, just, I don't remember what it is. I'm gonna accidentally push it one of these days <laughs> in the middle of an episode because I don't remember. I'm looking for like uh, my screenshot hockey or something like that. Hit suicide. I'm just like, huh, weird. Anyway. That's going to do it for today. I have to go check my Terraria stuff, and then I don't really want to record anymore. I mean, I do, but I don't want to commit to... Maybe another day we'll do, like, a, an endless until I die kind of situation. Maybe maybe another day. Not today. That's going to do it for today. Thank you for watching. Actually, let's take a look at this stuff. We got 180,000 damage dealt with the Deagles. 36,000 damage dealt with the Rhino. Only 5,000 damage dealt with the Glock. I really didn't do much with that, eh? It was really just, I mean, you know, deagles. What more can you ask for? 674 headshots. Don't take me to the next place. Yeah, I, I got I got a ways to go for my next one. I've done a few, like, several, many, many, many hours long endless runs before. So my, my stats are pretty high up there. Bunch of Z kills. Anyway, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, hit the like button. If you didn't like the video then um, please hit the like button because you respect me as a person you want to help with my growth and then don't you know watch the videos anymore but like just hit the like button to help me out you know I'd really appreciate it um, comment if you have anything to say subscribe if you want to see more in the future and I will see you next time when we don't play biotics lab because biotics lab is not really what I'm feeling right now but I'm not gonna be recording anymore today so maybe I'm feeling biotics lab tomorrow bye